Hi, this is Dr. David Tenner. We're here at the Goldberg Clinic, where we specialize in uh, helping patients reverse chronic health problems. And today we're joined by Ms. Donna Dabbs. And Donna came to see us from South Carolina. Yes, yes. South Carolina. And her first visit was back in June. And Donna's here for her about 90 day re exam. We started working with her a few months ago. Yeah, so, Donna, turn the floor over to you. What did you come in with initially? What was your experience medically? What was your experience with us? And what kind of advice would you have for people out there that are suffering with similar chronic health problems? Well, I came in with uh, severe fatigue, uh, joint pain that was throbbing, throbbing joint pain when I would go to bed at night, uh, busy, stress, just probably something that many, many, many deal with. Same as me. Um, I have thyroid issues, half of my thyroid has been removed. And I would always yo-yo around as far as being too tired or maybe being on too much thyroid medication. And I, I would sort of play around with my dose myself, actually, because I do have a nursing degree and a pharmacy degree. Um, but finally, I went, I, I was wanted to try something that not conventional um, medical. So I went to an alternative practitioner and I uh, mostly, I have a daughter also, I wanted to take her, so I took her to the, to, went to the alternative practitioner, and it was made, mostly a guessing game with lots of, I, I, I did see some improvement, but there was mostly a guessing game and lots and lots and lots of supplements. And that's and, actually a very common scenario. People think that when they go to an alternative doctor, they're getting something different. What they're actually getting is just another form of medicine. And so they usually combine taking drugs in some cases with all kinds of pills, including supplements, but it's still a medical approach and that's what your experience was. Right? Yes, yeah. yes, it was very difficult to do. And after a while I thought, gosh, I just, I can't do that anymore because while I had seen some improvements, I had not, I still felt like I should be different. It, it just wasn't what I was quite looking for. So I, of course, searching the web, I found the Goldberg Clinic and I came and the reason I wanted to come to the Goldberg Clinic is because I know what medication can do. I potentially thought I had rheumatoid arthritis, although it's not been tested and officially diagnosed. I know that's where I was going because I already have um, an autoimmune disease with Hashimoto's. And I know what, what medication can do to you. It's just a, a slippery slope. You just go down, you get worse and worse, and side effects from the drugs. I, like I said, I have a pharmacy degree, and so I did everything I could not to have that. you've seen that so many times. Yeah. Well, uh, the primary thing that we, uh, we wanted to work on with Donna is to understand what was causing her health problems in the first place, and then to sort of address those factors directly, rather than, as you just told me a few minutes ago, kill you to death. Yes. Right, which happens in so many other clinics. And after having um, started to address some of those root underlying factors and putting you through a process, what has now been the changes for you? What, what kind of improvements have you noticed? Uh, I feel a whole lot better after I eat. I, I have much more energy now. I get my rest at night. It took a while for me to get on the schedule of actually going to bed and getting to sleep. Before I had trouble falling asleep, and now I can sleep. Um, just overall, I feel better with an improved diet. How are your joints doing? Because you mentioned oh. the big improvement. They're, my joints are so much better. They're not throbbing. They don't do anything. Uh, they just, they are just, it's amazing. They're like, they don't hurt at all. Wow. One of the things I want to mention too is that Donna's lost about 13 pounds as a result of getting healthier. And then one more thing that's real significant, Donna came in, her cholesterol level was at 219. And your doctor wanted to put you on what at the time? My doctor wanted to put me on Lipitor, which I did not take because Lipitor is terrible, terrible. Right. So, I did not take that. <laughs> exactly. So we've been working with Don. She decided not to take the, the medication. And she just came in today and brought her new lab work. And your cholesterol is now at 145. And my endocrinologist was doing a little happy dance saying, that's great. You can go off the tour. And I'm like, no, I never went on. I never started it in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Donna, thank you so much for uh, sharing your story with us. I think your insights in, in terms of your background medically and pharm uh, pharmacology and nursing. Um, gives you a unique perspective and you've had a lot of experience with, uh, with drugs and the medical path and you decided even in the midst of after seeing all that that you want to take a different road. So thank you so much for joining us today and we're just absolutely thrilled with the uh, nice improvements that you've made. Thank you. Thank you.